Lots of illegal missions in this game. Hmm. Surely you're not seriously considering this course of action. The last thing we need is UC security on our backs. and sound and well I don't talk about mental health that's that's not <laughs> not anymore but anyway we started yesterday playing Starfield So UC is, is the big place. So last time we were like, yeah, we are we are with the Sarah. Talk to John Tuala in Mast. Not at all. My parents considered themselves to be enlightened. It, interesting, you can but ask a religious so question. Really pursue their beliefs. By the time I was old enough to start questioning these things. The idea of following any organized religion was almost an afterthought. It's not that I don't want to believe in anything. It's that my scientific mind is often at odds with my spiritual center, having been out there in the star field, seeing all those magnificent wonders with my own eyes. I need answers, not religious theory. I'm sorry if that disappoints you, but don't worry. While we're on this journey together, I fully intend to respect your religious beliefs. I believe in great servant. That this is actually pretty interesting because uh, Starfield is... <laughs> she has a smug smile. Starfield is, is uh, pushing the religion button. I mean, you can select your religion at the start and then you can actually... The uh, big questions of this games are revolving around... Well, big questions. <laughs> so, yeah. What, what's out there? Is there a god? You mean, apart from being the chair of Constellation for the past five years? Well, let's see. I pride myself with my aptitude so she's, she's, for she's navigator. calculating optimal trajectories for grab jumping. That's been quite useful in the past. And as far as planetary exploration, my area of expertise is botany. So, don't worry. I won't let you eat anything that might put you in the hospital. Exploration is my entire life. I consider it both a career and recreation. That being said, I will make a confession, but you have to promise to keep it between us. Before I graduated from school, I was in a band. And no, I don't mean the school band. I mean a rock band. We called ourselves Ironic Comet. <laughs> A ridiculous name, I know, but uh, we were just a bunch of teenagers getting together and having fun. And before you ask, no, I wasn't the lead singer. I actually played the drums. The band never really went anywhere, of course, but those were good times, and I remember them fondly. Well, at least she wasn't the bass player. I hope you got something out of that. Okay, some... Uh Discussions have a uh, that's all okay. That's all that it, it, it ex escapes the discussion, but tabulator is exiting the whole Talk to you later. dialogue. So we are going to the mast basically. Yet yeah, this game might might make some use of slight a uh, bit bit more s shaders, but I haven't really checked um, 
Mm, display options. Well, everything is on high, but it's up upscaled from the lower resolution. We have film grain. Okay. Might be more cool or cooler. Hello. Ah, well, isn't this a pleasant surprise? I hadn't expected to run into you again. Yes, well, I had good reason to be distressed. You had already helped me establish that there is something unprecedented going on with this tree. Now my superiors have been made aware. There is growing concern. Oh my, a bit of an unintentional pun, isn't that? Well, concern that things are going to get worse. The data we gathered points to tree rebellion. The vibrations coming from this tree are increasing in strength and frequency. Because we've never seen this before, not on this scale, we have absolutely no idea what the upper limit is. We don't know when or even if this will stop. It's imperceptible by normal human standards now, but given time. While I hesitate to speculate on the possibilities, well, none of them are good. I am attempting to formulate one, yes. But until I have all of the relevant information, it is impossible to do so. There is data regarding other, younger members of the species. Unfortunately, there are some, shall we say, personal issues with acquiring it. <clears throat> per per personnel issues, if you understand. Uh-huh, okay. And now you need my help again. Not necessarily, but if you're offering your services, you've certainly proven to be reliable. So, I need to go and scan the One trees. One of the other researchers in MAST, Emilio Hadek, has research I believe could be vital to my work. Oh, okay. He and I don't see eye to eye, and so far he's refused to turn it over to me. I'm hoping that if someone else were to ask, he might be more inclined to relinquish it. What do you say? Oh, thank you. At last I knew he was on a field assignment somewhere near the outskirts of the city. Uh, perhaps it's best if you don't mention my name in the process. Okay. We need to save the it's save the city. To think that this tree predates New Atlantis. Can you imagine all the changes it's seen? self-reliance in all your actions as members of the United Colonies Navy. I, I do. do. So these are basically uh, civilians. Now, you all have your assignments. Get out there and show them what the UC is made of. Oh, oh rather right, militia. So let's talk to the Sarah's contact. Okay. I interesting. Yeah, this this is a bit bit uh, Star Citizen like uh, interior decor. Sarah, good to see you. Who's your friend? <laughs> Hopefully, Constellation's newest member. Thought I'd run through some legwork together. Oh, another space explorer. Hey, you ever think of joining up with the Vanguard? Help the United Colonies, earn some credits, even get your UC citizenship? All right, all right. Can't blame me for trying, right? I mean, I still haven't given up on getting Sarah to re-enlist. It's a game we play. He asks, I say no. Here's what I got for you two. Vanguard volunteer by the name of Moera. Helps patrol the old neighborhood. Sol, Mars, Neptune, you know. The Sol system? Which Admiral did he upset to get that posting? He's Martian, born and raised. Not like I can get anyone else to care. 
Word is he's got some fancy metal ornament he's been showing off to the old grounders. Matches that description, sir. Ooh. Mars. Mars Matka. <clears throat> Oh, he goes way back. I think he was recruit number 81 or something. What? <laughs> no. Nah. Soul system is as quiet as a coffin. It'll be fine. That means it's not going to be fine. <laughs> I'm sure you two can handle it. Soul system is a lot of planets, but a vet like Moera will be checking in at Sidonia on the regular. You mean hitting the bars, don't you? Don't yeah, that, that's actually yeah, actually that's true. The little refresh between patrols. Solar system has a lots of lots of planets uh, in comparison of many other systems. Sidonia. Anything you can tell me about Sidonia? Yeah. Bring a coloring book. Get so used to seeing red, you'll forget what blues and greens look like. It's definitely a lifestyle, burning helium out there, seeing where the stars take you. I'm serious about that recruitment offer, by the way. You just come talk to me when you're ready. You see is a good friend to have. That would be interesting. Hey, Sarah's friend. You come to enlist at long last? Start earning your stripes with the Vanguard? Well, other than becoming a member of the greatest faction in the galaxy, you'd get access to discounted services on any UC world. Credits to help you get on your feet. You'd even be able to buy property right here in New Atlantis. Citizenship unlocks it all. And signing up for the Vanguard is the fastest way to earn it. Sir, sir service <laughs> provides citizenship. It's been a long time since I've been to Mars. Goodbye. Okay, so we are off to the Mars. Wish that bartender at the viewpoint would stop complaining to security. Was Emilio Hayek? An animations ha have always been like weak, weak point in in Bethesda's games. Not nothing to, nothing too special. Aika paljon dialogia. Miltä se peli tuntuu? Ää, peli tuntuu oikein hyvältä Skyrimin avaruudessa ja tarinaa on hyvin paljon. Nyt vaan juostaan ja autetaan ihmisiä niiden ongelmissa. Could you stand a little to the left? I think you're blocking my readings. Kill them for us, ask me to get some data for you. I'm in my own mass business to need some research on Please. data. Uh, I see what's going on here. You're working with Kelton. Boy, they help my base here. Nice try, but it's not happening. No, no way. Kelton is actively ruining my career. There's no chance that I'm helping him with anything. Whatever this thing is he's on about, he's just doing it to make himself look good with the higher ups. I'm not helping him with that. Kelton screwed me over good. Probably ruined my chances for Yeah, yo, voi voi craftata tak kanssa aika paljonkin asioita. Ever. Mut sun täytyy resursseja hommata niin kuin kaivelemalla ja ja luuttaamalla ja näin edespäin. Oh yeah. You think so? Wow. Thanks for that. I'll really give it some thought. Uh, he really won't let this go, will he? Hmm. Maybe I can make this work in my favor. Okay. You know what? 
I'll hand over the data. But I'm only going to do so after you've helped me secure a better position in MAST. Ah! Wait, really? Wow. Okay. Okay. Oletko kokeillut Gamepadilla vai onko PC-ohjaus parempi? Voidaan itse asiassa testata tuota. Kind of locked terminal. Okay, let's let's try try the controller. I started with the with the keyboard because blah, it's usually usually easier, but you know this this might be a lot better for the wrists. Mitä sait? Voiko save milloin vaan vai pitää korottaa pisteesi? Voi voi tota noin niin kuin. It's not that I don't want to do the right thing. Okay, look. Critical success. Just hear me out, all right? I really need this to happen. If you do this for me, I can make it worth your while. You delete that data, I get promoted. I'm pulling in a bigger salary. I can compensate you. I'll throw in some extra credits for you, okay? A nice little bonus. But first, you need to get into the chief engineer's apartment. Oh, good. Thank God. You really had me on the ropes there. Listen, this will be good for the both of us, okay? If it were up to me, we'd be walking Dis away from this deal right Dislike now. Dislike that. Then it's a good thing your partner over there is making all the decisions, isn't it? Just get in. Access her terminal, delete the files, and get out. Really simple. Oh, don't worry about it. It's just uh, pretty much. Voi, voi tallentaa milloin vaan. Most of it is fine. No, ei kesken kes keskustelu. I'm good what I do. I just received a few very unfair reviews recently, and I figure, why not start over completely? <laughs> ah, the old clean slate. <laughs> Used it myself once or twice. These are professional analytical. Uh, you've definitely been working with Kelton. He's starting to rub off on you. Best of luck out there. Okay, Sarah is bouncing over there. So how do I? Okay, that's a that's a weapon. This is. How do I put put this away? Sorry. <laughs> Oops. What's the matter with you? Oops. Sorry, Sarah. How do I put my <laughs> weapon away? Same button isn't actually taking it away. Alright, it's over there. No, see, I saw how got a yo. Man, I don't know, it's a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a Tämä on kyllä aika iso, iso kaupunki. Evening, sir. Nice place. Niin voi, 
voi quick savettaa tai tehdä tallennuksen koska, koska vaan. Joo, nää sivuhenkilöt pukittaa kyllä. Se on Pathfindingissa jonkinlainen ongelma. Siivousrobotti. So basically, lock picking is is uh, this kind of system, and it's it's pretty pretty okay in a in a sense that uh, you can actually fail this. So it's it's not like a do do anything and you succeed, but rather. You need to think about this order. Okay, this is actually a bit easier with the, with the controller. And you can actually mess this up, like I just did. Yeah, thanks for following. No, it succeeded. You learn to pick. You know what? On second thought, I don't want to know. Okay. Okay. B B button is the sneaking with the controller. Okay, computer, computer. Refused to carry out assignments starting they were beneath him and there were plenty of videos kun tää kuken scrape park. both of them so it's clean slate clean slate both of hey that's a sandwich let's steal a sandwich in a long time since 
I'll only carry the good stuff. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> okay, we can actually. Let's get moving. Little illegal stuff. Tarvitsee vissiin ottaa keskiviikkoon, kun peli julkaistaan. Minkä arvosanan annat tähän mennessä pelille? Tää on ihan hyvä. Tää on kolmonen tai, kolmonen tai nelonen. Yhdestä viiteen, viiteen asteikolla. Et siis, onhan tässä paljon tekemistä, mut, mut niinku, tää ei ole niinku simulaattori niinku Star Citizen on simulaattori taas. Oh, this, this, this guy is getting in trouble. Yeah, with his attitude. Yeah, thanks for watching. You have some good news for me? Yeah, I rear a cartoon no clean. Sure I took a peek on the network, saw that things have updated. Great job. You came through for me, so now I'll do the same for you. This slate has all the data Kelton needs. And because I am a man of my word, here are the extra credits I But found. but I at the same time actually removed the files from Kelton. So so now they are still eagle and this guy is getting trouble just because he has su such an attitude. Deliver data. really quite crucial. You don't want to, to know what I have to do to get this. You're absolutely right. I don't want to know. I'm sorry if this was complicated. I'd prefer to remain unaware of the details in the event that it comes up later. Particularly in a legal setting. <laughs> particularly in a legal setting. I'd better verify the data. Okay. Emilio didn't double cross me. But you have once again come through for me. Yeah, he he tried I'm to double crush Kelton. The last piece I need to figure out what we can do. Uh, cutting the thing down is always an option. I am doing all I can to avoid that. Yeah, definitely. Well, he he's, he's a biologist, so he's not keen to destroy the alien life form, even if it's a tree. Actually, this game is uh, giving me a itch to play Star Citizen. Because exploration oh, with a Star nice Citizen is not uh, slightly a bit, a bit better. I'll, I'll turn the volume down so won't record it. <laughs> oh boy, I didn't mean for you to take it personally. It's just something to say to customers. Break the ice, you know what I mean? Okay. <laughs> Listen. You just relax. Make yourself comfortable. You're welcome to stay as long as you want. That work for you, new guy? Let me know if there's anything I can get you. Well, that's what I'm here for. What'll it be? Okay, the expensive, expensive, expensive. Well, that's ex very, very expensive espresso. Okay, <laughs> nothing with these prices. You know, I had a guy in here last week ranting that General Shao ought to send the Marines down into the well. I'm usually all for letting folks speak their mind. Most times it can't be helped after a few drinks. But that was just too much. Anybody stuck living in the well, it almost well. certainly isn't by choice. And things down there aren't that bad. So what's what's well? I'm learning, learning about new, new places. Yep. Spaceport traffic. Yeah, thanks for watching. <laughs> but just between and following. I've got something in the works that'll change everything. A new drink that'll make this place famous, galaxy-wide. Pan galactic cargo buster or something. 
<laughs> Depends on what's it, what's in it. Well, at the moment, it's what's not in it that's an issue right now. I don't have everything for the recipe. I made a deal with Holler to bring me some small samples of an ingredient I think will make all the difference. But it never showed up. Turns out the guy I hired was also hired by a few other folks. The kind of folks who ship less than legal cargo. Security got wind, and the whole lot was impounded. Now they're just sitting on it, taking their sweet time like they always do. It's killing me. I submitted all the paperwork, believe me. It won't amount to anything, but I did it. And really, I'm not even certain this is what I need to finish the recipe. I just... I think it is. I need to get my hands on that cargo. I really do. It's gonna keep me awake nights if I don't try. Before we say anything else, I am in no way asking you to do anything that might violate any of the many, many laws in place here in New Atlantis or the larger United Colonies. Of course. This is just one friend talking to another friend, asking if maybe that friend could possibly find a way to get her important cargo out of the impound. And if, hypothetically, that were done in a less than 100% legal way, <laughs> That might not be the worst thing in the world. You, uh... Lots of illegal missions in this game. Hmm. Surely you're not seriously considering this course of action. The last thing we need is UC security on our backs. <laughs> Who do I need to kill? Uh... God, you have no idea what Okay, Sarah. I'm obviously not expecting Sarah you to Morgan doesn't like I I I think we didn't to de ditch her before we do anything illegal more way to get what I need Like I said I submitted the usual security release forms but she, she's a terrible person Sarah I mean I'm I'm just helping people uh, it might include breaking I some laws but the forms to matter yeah I went and talked to an officer at the office, too. Yumi. Sergeant, maybe? He was polite, but unhelpful. I declined to suggest that as their new slogan. New Atlanta security. Polite, but unhelpful. Truth in advertising, eh? <laughs> no hostages. Well, that was my idea. <laughs> I'm not worried. Okay, I'm not. apparently you can play you pretty terrible be? person in no, this game as well. Not. It'll be fine. Totally fine. I, I trust you. Catch you later. Okay, interesting. Be careful if you run into those ecliptic jerks. They fly around like they own the settled systems. They like to use old abandoned facilities as outposts. You know, ones that don't leave the colony. So, okay, we need to fly to the Mars. We could actually. Okay. I'm st stuck in a weird place. Well, hello. You hear about the job by any chance? Uh, the officer over there can help you with any bounty issues. Part time security officer. The position's very flexible. Uh, you can basically work whenever you're available. No pressure. We've had some gaps in the schedule lately. Macy's out on maternity leave. Jose's on loan to Sidonia. When it rains, it pours type of situation. So really, we just need someone to fill the void. Interested? Well, uh, first things first, I have to ask. Do you have any security experience at all? Sure counts for something. I mean, you're alive. And resilience is definitely an important trait for any officer. Okay, so th there's lots of well, side quests you could uh, basically I do. All I need. Your first assignment couldn't be easier. Go to Mast and check in with Agent Plato at Aegis. There was a package left at a dead drop and they need UC security to handle it. He'll fill you in on the details. 
you know, masks. Okay. The military, administrative, and scientific triumvirate. Giant building in the center of the city. Oh, that one. Headquarters of the entire United Colonies? I really should have given you a more thorough <laughs> Too late. Aegis, they're basically UC intelligence. They help identify threats to New Atlantis before they become problems. While we're separate departments, there are times we need to rely on each other, so it's important to keep a good working relationship. We do Agent Plato this favor, and maybe he'll toss us some intel when an investigation stalls. Tit for tat. You know how it works. Yeah, we all got friends who need things. But we've also got rules and regulations, and I'm not going to bend them. Your friend can file a request like everyone else. Well... Just because you're bringing it here doesn't mean that's where it'll end up. Let me know if you have any questions. Interesting. What if I help this person and he helps me to help another you person? What you might have heard. You see security personnel are good people. And Sergeant Yumi just happens to be an old friend. Ah. Suppose I have time for a nap before we leave? Hmm? Okay, so, uh, like I said, I'm a terrible person. I made a huge mess in here. Let's take off. So, uh, civilian outpost, science outpost. Clear road. Back to the system. We haven't really been exploring much of yet. So we are heading, heading to the Earth. Alpha Centauri to Sol. our solar system Charon Uranus yeah Uranus has a this many planets Let's go to Earth first, because why, why not? So there's lots of stuff around. Uh, I don't think I should be... Yep. And Earth has changed its, its color since since to be last. So, so humans managed to ruin Earth. I can actually see, still make out the. May 
make out the world. Rough, rough shapes. So this is Scandinavia and uh, this is Finland. So let's let's land about where where I live. Sandy desert. So wel welcome to the Tampere region in Finland. Yep, that looks about right. Okay, CC changed to the spacesuit. Also, also I could. Now try to boost. Of course this is 1G and not uh, lighter. But yeah. Ah, uh, Tampere looks about right. Surface map. So this is thought, uh, procedurally generated, and surprisingly, there's not much of ruins anywhere. Okay, a physical feature. Unknown feature. Iron nickel alloy. Because there's there's not much much to see, honestly. And I, I suppose this is something that modders modders will uh, fix. So planets will have more stuff and we are waiting to like fans fans of the game to create something something interesting leads us to Mars so let's let's do the Mars trip now Basically, Mech Factory on Mars, Sidonia, Mars la Launch Pad, Launch Pad, Sidonia, Mars. I wonder if these, these two are different location. Probably they are. So, definitely, this game focus has been like exploring other worlds than Earth. Sad thing, really. I lived on Mars for an entire year, and I'm convinced I'll never get used to the dusty air. Yeah, I can, I can jump a, a bit better at the lower gravity. So, so far this doesn't feel as powerful as with the 
Mass Effect Andromeda Rocket Bags Mining Call Colony of Sudonia By the way, my Mars sand should be a bit toxic. And radi radiation. Welcome to Sudonia. Human is stepping stone to the stars. Well, that, that figures. Fifty hours, <laughs> hours without the incident. How much money we spent to hitch a ride to this dusty red rock? We were told there were jobs. Look, 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 I get it. But we just filled our last openings. I think we have a couple contracts ending at the end of next month. Possible they may not extend. This is bullshit. I got a wife and kids at home. We can't wait almost two months for a job that may not even exist then. Hey, hey, I get it. There's nothing I can do. It's out of my hands. You can take it up with corporate. Sorry, but I have to get back to work. Come on, forget it. Let's get out of here. Hey. Hello. Okay, hello. Keep it simple. Not everyone needs to come to me with their problems. I ain't a psychiatrist. He ain't been around. Went off on patrol. Hasn't been back in since. We're starting to think it might be time to pour one out to the blackest sea. You in the service? I know the feeling, but uh, you just get so used to losing people. Look, nothing more I'd love than to help out a fellow Martian, especially one that's missing. But. <clears throat> He has a tab, and you don't know if he's coming back. A lot of credit. Oh, he, he sees a lot of. Ha, have been drinking a lot. If I'm out all that money, I got problems. What do you say? Come on. Life on Sidonia ain't hard enough. You did a guilt trip me. Yes. So three turns, two, three turns to get four levels of persuasion. Guess I should ask you the same question. Okay, so I'm failing. Are you paying or what? Maybe. Uh, one turn. Uh That's what I'm hoping. I'm glad you understand the position I'm in here. Okay, now no, I succeed. All right, I give up. Just trying to earn a living here. Last time he was here, Moera kept yelling about the Lady of Love. Lady of Love. Singing songs, all that kind of thing. Venus? That's only one planet. Hardly an entire patrol route. I got what I got, okay? Fine. We'll make do. Yeah, Venus is a horrible place. I don't know why I did that. Okay, what's that? Probably nothing serious. Trevor. Look at this place. I can't imagine being cramped down here, choking the fumes and the dust. 
No trees, no grass. It's depressing. Unauthorized mining to Sidonian security. Several areas currently zoned as residential are seeking to allow. Face of Mars. Welcome, nice to meet you. Name's Trevor, mining director for the Deimos Mining Project here in scenic underground Sidonia. I could spare a minute or two to chat, so long as you're not looking for mining work, I suppose. Uh, not so bad for one of the oldest mines in the settled systems. We struggle with the lack of decent equipment, but we work hard and make up for it. So this is about you know, a couple hundred years old. We're responsible for resources to Deimos Star Yard. Which in turn is responsible for supplying you. Ah, okay, now I understand. That, among other major projects, makes us one of the United Colony's most important mining operations. The prestige and pay that comes with it almost makes up for being stationed at the arse end of the settled systems in the middle of nowhere. Argos, huh? Now I've heard of them. That's great, but yeah. Unfortunately, all our mining contracts are filled right now. Unless, maybe you could help me out with a job. Off the books. Uh-huh. Nah, well, well, if I'm being up front, maybe a little. But I promise, it's harmless. See, you might have noticed that our equipment ain't exactly holding together like it used to. Problem is, we can't get new equipment unless we start exceeding our quotas. We can't do that until we get new equipment. A real dilemma, right? All right. I've got a plan for solving our little problem, though. Okay. Glad you're still on board. First, I need someone from the outside to bolster our yields so we can prove that we can exceed our quota. I'll fill you in on the rest of the details after you've hauled up some ore. One standard quota should do. I need to know I can trust you with the easy stuff first. When you've got enough, drop it off in the bin over there for processing. Then come see me. So, okay, these are activities you can you can do. I can't imagine being stuck down here gathering rocks for a living. Uh, are you shooting at flies now? No, rocks. Okay, th this was easy. Okay, what's okay. what's what's the deal? I see, you're serious about helping me. Great. Now, the next part is a little trickier. Our director of mining operations, Peter Brennan, fired his last assistant over a month ago. Peter's the only one who can approve the order for new equipment, and unfortunately, he's useless without an assistant. I think I've got a surefire way for you to get that job. Then you, as his assistant, can get him to sign off on the approval. We just need you to take the job until we get the approval signed. Then you can quit, keep it, or do whatever. It's not as bad as it sounds. Worst case scenario, you may have to go fetch some stuff for him and go over his messages. It'll be easy, I promise. Now hold on, it's not that easy. You'll need to apply for it like anyone else. 
Head to the Demo Star Yard's office up in orbit to fill out the application. It's where that job is posted. Come back and see me when you've done that, and we'll talk about how to secure the position for you. You're jumping through a lot of hoops to get those miners the equipment that they need. Red planet. I suppose this might be a grand tour of the solar system, this, this quest. That would be like a really logical thing. Uh, not, not there. Serpents impress you. We can distract them with a litany of the weight. I give, will give you passage to reserve. Well, Religions are important part of this game. Okay, so now we now the, now we know where to go. This is grand tour of the <laughs> solar system. I suppose if we are probably going to set down on Earth as well, because that's how I would design this game. Maxim maximize the drama. Where the first interstellar ships were made. 
People still use their modules, even though their star yard hasn't been running in forever. I want to walk on the moon. Keep your weapons ready. Never know who else might be scavenging there. He's definitely playing the, the same card than Star Citizen that you can actually walk around well while the ship is flying. But it's it's not as good. Okay, that's that's too close enough. Dog. Good to be back on board. Um, why do you say that? Two steps in and we're Yep. Okay. It's not Vanguard Moara. Looks like spacers were scavenging around here and someone else came in and said hello. Oh, this might be your last encounter with the space crew. Pillage abandoned facilities and shoot anyone who gets in their way. So spacers are less organized than the cruiser duty. Just countless desperate Pick, that's that's useful. Okay, that's advanced, so we can't get there. I'm not really good at lock picking. I probably probably shoot is shooting next. A rifle, a rifle certification would be really, really nice at this point. Okay, let's mute the warning. Okay, mercenaries. These are pretty, pretty dummies.
I'm the damn ghost stealing your stuff in the night. Clear out while you have the chance. Much better odds destroying one of their ships than fighting them all at once here. So this is a ship, okay. Naval Cutlass. Okay, it's a, it's a, it's a sword. Let's replace the axe with this. You see security uniform. Funny how this is, should be like a really old place, but these are basically same items you can find anywhere. Secure access. Loading modified Grendel. That's actually pretty, pretty nice. Yeah, I'm, I'm just hoarding stuff once again. From from the different factions. Some mines with me and okay. We are off. Selector. Okay, I was pressing long press and not. Okay, Sarah is helping me to fly this ship. So, Neptune. Or over here. Happy to respond. It's not me. Mark's hijacked my ship. Why find a couple of 
they stall out, we'll have our chance. Okay, how do I target the ship's engines? Okay, how do I target? No, no, I need to check the settings because you, it's a tutorial, but you didn't give me any advice, game. So that's that's why. So uh, select target E. Once again, would be nice to know how, how exactly I'm going to target the certain component. Space on his flight mode switching. But, uh, okay, Z, Z and X. Target lock. How, how do I know which which system I am? Okay, that's my system. This is constantly targeting the central mass of the of the sheep. Trying to aviate. Okay, now we start the docking routine. Come on, let's go rescue that vanguard. Okay, not what I had in mind, but sure, it works, kind of. So, where to next? This, this, this dock, docking clamp. Where's the western? Okay. That's a toilet. Okay, where's the cockpit on this ship? Okay, weird. Let 
need to know the next room. Okay, so this is the door. He sees stuff. Very tough. Looking for critical hit. Life. Ah, am I glad to meet whoever you two are? Looks like we're all in one piece. Any day you walk away from, right? Yeah, about. What? You guys still exist? Man, I've only heard stories. We've heard stories too. About a strange object you found on patrol. So, you know what that thing is. I tried to hawk it in Sidonia, and the guy thought I was peddling phony titanium. Mm, it doesn't play nice with scanners. It'd be worthless to someone trying to flip rare minerals quickly. So you're saying I shouldn't be using it as a hood ornament? Uh, no. <laughs> hey, I'll trade some weird space rock for a rescue anytime. Hope you figure out whatever that thing is. Let's grab the artifact. Yeah, it's a hood ornament. Good work. Let's get back to the lodge. 